Hey loves, welcome or welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Katya. For today's video, if you follow me on Instagram, you know that in one of my Insta stories, I had asked for your feedback and your opinion on this, and it was to whether or not to start vlogging. The reason why I had asked was, I feel as though I would want to put out more videos for you guys, but the reason I can keep up with it is because, first of all, DIYs, if you're a DIYer like me, you know that every DIY is very time consuming, whether it's going by the supplies, coming up with the idea, just creating the DIY, and then I have to edit the videos so there's always this big huge gap in between each video and what I wanted is to put out more videos at least once a week that would be my goal so what I thought was to start vlogging taking on my little adventures whether it's going to flea markets thrift stores home decor fashion stores taking you guys with me so today is the day that we are going to do that and I'm super excited we are heading off to Saint Stash which is in Montreal Canada and we are heading to a flea market so half of the market is all new stuff and then there's another part of the market where there's a lot of antiques and just random people selling their stuff from their home so fingers crossed we find some really cool treasures today so we are off and I will see you guys in just a little bit So I'm going to turn you guys around and it is over there, if you guys can see. So it's a pretty big flea market, honestly, it's, I, it's pretty much the, the biggest flea market that I've seen or I've been to. If you look, this is the flea market right now, it's super cool. It's sort of a rainy day, it's gonna, I'm not sure if it's gonna rain today, it's like a cloudy day, but we'll see. We'll see, hopefully it doesn't rain. Some people are wearing their uh, masks, some people are not. Oh, let me just see. Okay, yeah, exactly. Yeah, we want to be uh, responsible for you losing a major home. I actually like this one. No? Hi. Hi. So that was a stand of like sort of imitation Louis Vuitton, um, Chanel, Michael Kors. But um, I don't know. I don't care. I'm not much of a person, name brand person. I don't mind if it's fake, real. So we're gonna keep going. I know they sell a lot of glasses. If you look here, like sunglasses, purses. Um, there's some hats. This is the more newer side where they sell all things new. But there's also the other side there where there's like random, like random people selling their house stuff. But they usually leave earlier. So. See again more uh, like fake Gucci's, Louis Vuitton things. I sort of like this. Those are just practical when you're walking around with them. Is there a backpack? I wanted like a backpack one. Hi, how are you? Do you have any like Louis Vuitton backpacks? Like little little backpacks? I'm not so big because I know there's a big one there, but maybe smaller. Oh, okay. That yeah, no, smaller, smaller. No way. Eh? It's okay. So okay. thank you so much. Thanks. It's <laughs> so cute. They're so cute. They're smarties. Hello. 
You guys know I love my bracelets. Super cool. See, these ones are really beautiful. I'm just randomly looking and if I see something that I like then I will probably get it if not then it's not meant to be so see there's more Louis Vuitton things here I'm sort of looking more for like a backpack like this actually no this is a little bit too fake <laughs> this is not not even the Louis Vuitton fake imitation and there's even some games look how cute that is so fun Oh, there's hats. We guys, you guys know I love a good hat. These are like bucket hats. Some jewelry. See over there, there's more like antique stuff there. So let's go check there because I know that they close earlier. The sort of like, I guess, not garage sale, but where the people sell more mostly like antiques and home decor stuff from their home. I know they usually um, close a little bit earlier. So let's maybe start off more like with, like you see the antique section here. Um, just because I don't want them to close. Like, see, people are already starting to put things away. So. I see this is beautiful. Some creepy dolls here, guys. Oh. <laughs> Do you know if you guys know me, you guys know I am not a fan of dolls. I just think that they are the creepiest things. There's like furniture there too. Old DVDs. And cool bikes. Look at this one. Look at the tires on this. It's crazy. Super cute. So we're gonna try to go like street, not street by street, but like row by row just so that we don't miss anything because I don't know. I don't have a whole process of how I'm gonna film this, but I'm just gonna go up and down the different aisles here. Oh my gosh, look how cute this hat is here. Super cute. Probably, I probably have too much of a big head for this. Nice. It's too small. My head's too big. <laughs> Yeah, it's beautiful, but my head's too... It, I see it, I have a big head. <laughs> Thank you. It's pretty, much, <clears throat> it's pretty much a hit or miss when it comes to the people who are selling stuff. You can either find people that are super friendly, super nice, and then you can find people that are just not friendly and just, yeah, just not nice. Let's just put it this way, so. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Oui. Oh, t'es fine. Merci beaucoup. T'es dans des fines. Toi aussi. Moi, bye. That's so sweet. That's like the sweetest thing when someone comes up to you and tells you that they actually enjoy your style. Um, I so appreciate it. It honestly, it melts my heart. It just, I don't know. So. I try to do that too sometimes. If I see someone that has a really cool style or fashion sense, I tend to like want to go up to them and just 
just let them know that I'm loving their style just so that it sort of changes the whole positive outlook on um, someone's day, right? Someone can be having a horrible day and if you make a super, if you make a compliment, it can totally change everything for a person. So that's what I try to do. But when someone does it to me, I just, I don't know, I think it's so sweet, you know? But anyway. We'll go towards the other side. They're already, they're starting to shut down now, putting things away. So there's not much left, honestly. So let's go on the newer side so we can maybe get a couple things for you and show you a couple pieces that people are selling. Maybe next time I'll come a little bit earlier so that, you know, we can look more on the uh, secondhand stuff. But as of right now, we're just gonna go look at the new stuff. Oh, look at this old um, typewriter here. Super cool. These trains, I guess these are like collectibles. Some cute little handmade slippers. Just like fuzzy pillows here. Oh, there's some Harley Davidson stuff here, like sweatshirts, t-shirts. I'm assuming that they're all uh, like imitation. See like Nike. Cute. Mickey Mouse like a Gucci. Adidas, Nike. More imitation stuff. See, they even sell from fruits and vegetables. If you guys don't know, I am actually someone that loves to... I don't like meat. I don't eat meat. I'm pretty much all about plant-based foods and that's just what I like eating. It's what I prefer. It's not for everybody, but I just live pretty much on fruits and vegetables, nuts, and um, yeah, whether flax seeds, hemp seeds, pumpkin seeds. Some caps here. Eight dollars. That's pretty good. Let's see what we have here. No, no. Super cute. Hi. Thank you. Thank you. You too. You too. Thank you. You're so sweet. Thank you. Oh, you're so sweet. I appreciate it. You're on my YouTube channel now. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm telling you guys, it makes my day every time. I'm not even kidding you. It just makes me feel so, I don't know. I'm shy, but yet, I don't know. It just makes me feel so nice. So I appreciate it. Anyway, we're going to keep on shopping, keep on looking for things. Oh, there's some soaps here. Some handmade soaps. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> you make them yourself? I do. You do? So cool. Awesome. So 100% natural. We love that. You guys know. Love things with no chemicals and crap. <laughs> Agree? <laughs> exactly. So cool. Yeah. You have lavender? Yeah. yeah. Not sure which. Oh, right here. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Okay. I think I'm gonna take one. I'll sure. take one of those. Chamomile. We love a good lavender. Can't go wrong with lavender, That's right? The best yes. Are you here every time? Yeah, I'm every. Usually here every weekend. Uh, usually not both days. Okay. Saturday or Sunday. Okay. Depending on the weather. Okay. They cool. said it was gonna rain tomorrow, so. Okay. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little recording, but it's okay. You can go check. It's, I, I'm filming everybody and different, everyone, you know, their different stands. And yeah, yeah, of course, of course, here. It's Sensamu, guys. You guys, check it out. You have a website too, so people can order online. Perfect. All plant based, all plant -based vegan friendly products. Cool. Well, you heard it from the, the person who makes them, so yeah. <laughs> Your name is? Wendy. Wendy. Nice to meet you. I'm Katya. So it's Cast and Nikolai if you want to go check it out. You'll okay. be there. Yeah. I will. Yeah. I will do. Cool. Yeah. Thank you. Sorry, eh? It's okay. Thank you. 
Thank you. No, no, no. No, no, no. Please. No, honestly. You're so sweet. No, no. I, I really appreciate it. I wouldn't feel... Honestly, I, I love supporting. Honestly. Thank you so much. I appreciate it, though. That is the sweetest thing. I'm gonna have to give you change. Oh, no problem. No problem. Sorry, I only had a 20. It's okay. See, guys, there's so many different uh, types. There's lait de coco, carte avoine. There's so many. There's even a cute little SpongeBob, guys. So cute. <laughs> For kids, it's perfect. And adults. And ad of course, yeah, yeah. Let's not discriminate. Yeah. Oh, I'm I'm sure. It's true. It's true. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Bye. See you. Bye. See you. <laughs> super fun. See, it's either nice or not nice. And she was super, super cool. I just love supporting people that sell natural things and that are just upbeat, positive. And to me, that's where it's all about. It's just encouraging people and helping support vendors and just, oh, there's jewelry here, guys. Oh. Oh, they're ankle bracelets. These are like belt buckles. So cool. <laughs> How funny is this guy here? M. Look at this. Mom. Let's see if. Ici, on a un P. Est-ce que vous voulez papillon ou Pikachu? Pikachu. Pikachu ou papillon? Pikachu. I always find it funny. You guys know to follow me on Instagram again. Um, I mentioned that I love fairs. I just think that they're so fun. Okay. Got this guy just creeping and looking at me in a weird way. Did you see that guy? Oh, he's still doing it. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Like I was saying, some really nice people or some creepy people. Look how beautiful jewelry. Oh, you guys know I love my arm cuffs. Nice. I like this one here. I wish that there were smaller ones, you know? Hi! Thank you, thanks. You guys close at 4? Close? Close? People are starting at 5. 5, okay. Yeah, because people are putting things away early, right? Okay, thank you. I guess people are getting ready to pack stuff up a little bit before, so I'm not sure why. <laughs> I would think that they would start packing maybe, I don't know, a quarter to five, but... Some cool jewelry. Oh, look at his dog! So cute! Do you see him? Oh, he's so cute. So, I don't know. I came last time and I just loved his jewelry. I think that they're super, like, just different. And, like, look at this one. Look how beautiful that one is. See, this one is really pretty, too. So, I think this is pretty much the last row. Um, I don't know, I feel like there's a lot less of vendors that there normally is. Usually there's a little bit more. The last time I came there was a lot more. But, um, I don't know. I don't know if it's because people are closing up a little bit earlier, or... I'm not sure. But anyway, I'm gonna keep filming. Oh no, there's two more rows, guys. Two more. And then, that's pretty much it. <laughs> so, so far, got a hand soap. And, um, 
I'm looking for maybe more like a bag, like a sort of fake Louis Vuitton, maybe backpack or some sort of bag. And I see a stand right there. So maybe we can go check them out. See if they sell that too here. Yeah. Hi, dear. Hi, how are you? Good, you? Good. <laughs> I was looking for um, a smaller Louis Vuitton backpack. You, you don't have one. No? Okay. okay. But I'm still gonna look around. Maybe I'll see something else that yeah. I like, right? So I guess you didn't have Louis Vuitton. <laughs> So anyway, we'll just keep shopping. Maybe there's further up. I see other um, ugh, people are smell, smoking weed and it smells. Weed, cigarettes, it's just not my thing. Every time I smell that, it just grosses me out. I don't know. I don't know how much. I think it's well. Hi, how much is this one here? Yes. 30. 30? Okay. Okay. Yeah. I think I'll get it. Yeah, thank you. I was looking for a backpack yeah. like this. It's good. It's very good. Do you have? I have uh, the, yeah. Yeah, I think I like the mini one. Yeah, smaller. Yeah, I think. Thank you. Perfect. Thirty, right? Oh, so, okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. See you. Bye. So I got my bag. Super happy. I actually ended up finding it. It's not a real one, but I swear, guys, eventually I will be able to buy myself one. That'll be my like accomplishment of being able to buy a real one. But as of right now, fake it is. <laughs> no one, no one will know the difference, right? So, still just as happy, right? Handbags here, and um. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Here there's like jams and like little like food stuff. Yum. There's some like jam right there. Some cookies. Okay guys. So that is pretty much it. <laughs> it wasn't long, but we still got to see a little bit of things. If you guys enjoy it please comment down below let me know you know if you guys want to keep filming things like this and maybe to different places like i said it doesn't have to be um flea markets it could be thrift stores home decor um anything that has to do with um shopping and taking you guys along with me right so anyway i'm gonna keep shopping and show you guys a little bit more and we're gonna head towards the car Mwah. love you guys I just recently got these boots that I'm wearing right now and usually my Doc Martens are like the comfiest shoes ever but for some reason these ones are killing my feet right now like all the back I'm sure I'm getting blisters so pretty much these ones right now so they're super nice super cool I think they just need to be broken into they're still a little bit stiff if you love Doc Martens you know that you have to keep wearing them in order to sort of I don't know fit you better and just make it that they're more comfortable and more suited for your feet um, I almost got run over it so anyway right now I'm gonna go sit in the car and just take it easy so that I don't have to keep walking with these freaking shoes and people are just staring at me it's crazy no my feet are really killing me guys really killing me. I'm like having trouble walking to the car. The things you do for fashion, I'm telling you guys, the things you do. Okay guys, I told you. So this is pretty much what my Doc Martens just did to the back of my foot. So yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna have to break these in, that's for sure. So if you enjoyed this video, I will put other videos similar to this one. Um, I think I'm going to put actually one right up here and you guys can go click it. Check out my last one. It is a come thrift with me. And just thank you all so much for watching. I love you always. Mwah. Bye.